what connects them, what kind of bond connects them in the middle? Yep. A hydrogen bond. And the cool thing about hydrogen bonds is they come apart very easily. The LEGO DNA Learning Center sets are used to simulate what molecules are doing inside of the cells. My whole motivation in making these LEGO DNA sets was to give students the delight of finding about how the cell works. Ones were the t originals? This one? Yeah. This one. This one. Right, great. The LEGO sets includes sets of DNA, includes sets of proteins, and then also includes uh, the tRNA package, which allows us to teach about protein synthesis. For anybody, student or adult, who has almost no knowledge of DNA, it's extremely easy for them to come in and put some of the base pairs together and instantly have a better understanding of DNA or protein structure. Having the actual Legos there and actually physically being able to break apart the bonds because of the temperature. This is what we're doing in the lab. That's what these little tiny amounts of liquid are doing. You're right, you have to base pair with the top, right? You guys One of the big advantages about using the LEGO DNA Learning Center set is that you can use it at many different levels. You can use it with very young kids and you can use it with adults very effectively. It brought up so many questions that all of us were sitting around the table and I think we could have sat around the table for another hour or two. There are different bonds, different tables. You have 